obviously there's a lot going on in our industry and taking over an organization with 23,000 people and a long legacy there um, I think in order to, to be effective I realized that there had to be a, a better way um, the book simple was actually sent to me by one of our financial advisors who had experienced the complexity of our organization and I took the time to read the book and it was I thought it was profound and it was obvious but it was also very practical and so I started to think about the you know the tenets of what Alan had described as it relates to our company and it was easy for me to get excited about what could be making things more simple is more human what we do is innately human it's an interaction between an advisor and a client I think what we have to be careful of is to fight um, sort of the trends of information flow because it can overwhelm everybody and so we've got to make sure that we filter that the right way and present it to our clients in a way that any human could comprehend so whether it's an interaction between an advisor and our client and the language that our advisor chooses uh, and the way that we present information to our client all the way to the systems that we ask um, our people to interface with our ability to gather information from clients but also allow our advisors to input that information so the whole process the system has to be simple and we get better outcomes when people understand what it is you know and then all the way through our marketing the contractual language every facet of what we do simple can add value to for Merrill Lynch Wealth Management trying to simplify the process working very hard to do that in a way that empathizes with our clients is absolutely a competitive advantage to us.